Hi, my name is Marie Dinsell, and I'm the head of global sponsorships and the Olympic Games for Cisco. We said, wow, there's so many parallels with the Olympic platform DNA and Cisco's DNA as a culture. We came up with an amazing contest. We are very excited to share our Cisco employee stories with you. They are truly amazing. We call these employees Cisco Olympians. Hey guys. Hi. Hi. Hi everyone. My name is Kate Baldwin. I'm Chunji. My name is Alexander Faroni. I'm B. Lynn. Shrikant Narasimhan. Mary Waite Bradburn. Luis Pui. Cody Bell from Santa Fe, Texas. Mercer Island, Washington. And I'm from London. Raleigh, North Carolina. Sao Paulo, Brazil. When I found out that I was going. So I get the call. My first reaction was. Oh. <laughs> What? The first person I called was obviously my mom. Guess what? Guess what? My jaw dropped. I can literally hear her jumping up and down, just going crazy on the side. <laughs> I felt very humble, deeply proud. That, that's, that was beautiful. Our Cisco Olympians are going to be able to carry the Olympic torch through the country of Brazil leading up to Rio 2016. I'm carrying the torch. Carrying the torch. I'm carrying that torch. I'm carrying the torch for my son, Vitor. My son was born with Down syndrome. I carry the torch for anybody who's ever been touched by cancer. And I'm carrying the torch for the next generation of girls in technology. For my daughter to show everybody that nothing is impossible. I'm carrying it on behalf of special needs families all around the world. Because I believe in creating opportunities for everyone. I'm representing those children that have been inspired, excited, and engaged to pursue a career in STEM. I'm carrying the Olympic torch to further the Olympic ideal. I was able to really channel that passion into an initiative that I founded to attract young people, try and excite them in all the possibilities that are out there. Nine months of very hard work and a lot of sleepless nights supporting 384 medical evacuation missions was uh, a pretty proud moment. All my focus and determination has to do in believing in his potential. Every single year, I put on this event called Girls Advancing Technology. It's a nice way of opening their eyes. Math and tech are not just for boys. 16 months ago, I was told I had nine months to live. I'm still here fighting. I love the fact that the gold is wearing off because there have been so many little kids who got to touch this and hold this and get really excited about possibly becoming an Olympic athlete one day themselves. I feel pride. I'm representing Cisco. I think this is a special family and it never ceases to amaze me what we can do. It's been a very inspiring, a very motivational, and a very touching journey for all of us here at Cisco. And we're very proud to deliver Rio 2016. Hey, Tim Cisco. Team Cisco. And I'm very proud. I'm proud to be Cisco Olympian. Cisco Olympian. Cisco Olympian. Cisco Olympian. I'm a Cisco Olympian. So thank you. We are ready for real 2016.